One Lincoln County woman is fighting for her life after she was diagnosed with a chronic kidney disease and dealing with treatments for the condition is becoming mere difficult. 13 News reporter Haley Kosick joins us in the studio to explain why she isn't alone. Haley. Hannah, Fresenius Kidney Care provides dialysis at several locations in West Virginia, including Hamlin, which is fairly new, but after almost two years, the company is now closing its doors, putting its rural patients in a tough spot. Dialysis is a complex, tedious, and time-consuming procedure that filters and cleans your blood after your kidneys have failed. Six years ago, Pamela Smith it just left me very without Ill knowing lost of the function what, of her kidneys, what was, what was going to happen to me. Two-month-long coma. She was advised to begin dialysis and was driving to Huntington four times a week to get treatment, which wasn't ideal. And then by the time that you're over dialysis and you start to come back, I am so tired, I'm about ready to just fall in the bed. And because it takes so much out of you, it makes you sick, and you just don't feel like doing anything for two or three days after. The opening of the Fresenius Kidney Care Center in Hamlin made things much more simple because it was a 10-minute drive down the road from Pamela. But a few days ago, she found out that location would be closing its doors February 3rd. According to the clinic manager, those undergoing treatment can go to another clinic or have the option to dialyze at home. The closest clinic for Pamela is in Huntington, which is a 50-minute drive one way. They keep telling me that uh, it's because they didn't have enough money. They're not making enough money. And the surrounding areas are not sending patients from there to up here where some of them live. Now, Pamela is currently on the list waiting to receive a kidney transplant and at this time is unsure of what her treatment plan will be going forward. Hannah, back to you. Haley, thank you.